Well, it's only the middle of May, but it's going to feel more like August pretty soon. Meteorologist Kate Bilo here with the summer like stretch headed our way. It is going to be toasty. It is going to be hot by the end of the week. Totally. It's going to be like where you're sticking to the seats of your car kind of weather, and you're going to have the AC cranking because we're talking. 90 degrees likely by the weekend, maybe even sooner than that. We'll have to keep an eye on the middle of the work week as well. Right now, it is beautiful outside. If only it could just stay like this forever. 75 degrees, sunny, low humidity. The dew point is in the mid 30s right now. Virtually no humidity in the air. Winds are out of the west southwest about 11 miles per hour. Temperatures have risen anywhere from 2 degrees in Atlantic City. Up to 10 degrees higher in Reading and Lancaster than it was at this time yesterday. So today, the warming trend continuing, and it's only going to skyrocket from here. Going to add a bunch of red squares to the calendar. That includes today. So far, 76 is the high, and we only have five days above average. 11 below. That will probably be neck and neck by the time we hit this weekend, which of course is how averages are found to begin with. Storm Scan 3 showing a few spotty showers and thunder showers. These have mainly miss the area. They've been up across southern New England. We had a couple of sprinkles up in the Poconos. We had one pop up over Atlantic County. You can see one more up there over Burlington County, but that one has completely rained itself out and it's not happening anymore. So really we are quiet through the remainder of tonight. We will see an increased chance for spotty showers and storms as we head toward the weekend with the uptick in heat and humidity. Tonight 57, mainly clear, mild, quiet, light breeze from the southwest at 5 miles per hour. Tomorrow is sunny and beautiful. It's a little warmer than today, but 80 degrees with low humidity. All right, we can sign off on that in the month of May. It's the heat and humidity coming for the weekend that's going to be just a little difficult to stomach when you need to have the air conditioner running in mid May. It feels like summer. You can see we start to see those brighter orange colors lift in, and then by Wednesday, mid to upper 80s take over, and that's where we will likely stay right into the weekend. Now, Saturday does bring our best chance for a few scattered showers and thunder showers, but not a ton of precipitation in the forecast right into the weekend. So we could hit 90 possibly by midweek, but certainly our forecast high on Sunday is 90 degrees, and if we get there, it'll be the first. 90 degree day since last August. It's been a little while. Precipitation chances again very low tomorrow, Wednesday, and Thursday. Chance of an isolated thunder shower there Friday. Saturday brings our best chance. It's still not a widespread threat, but pop up showers and storms likely on Saturday with that heat and humidity. So again, you can see by Thursday, we're already approaching 90. Friday, mid to upper 80s, and the weekend is hot and steamy. It is going to feel like a summer weekend out there. So if you have friends with a pool, if you have a sprinkler you can put in the backyard, maybe a makeshift slip and slide, Yuki, I would highly recommend it this weekend. I have a slip and slide. There you go. Yeah. I can picture you doing that. <laughs> <laughs> Just like flat out. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I have nothing for that one. That was pretty good. All right. Thanks, Kate.